Hello and welcome back, folks. I'm Manic Mink. This is Assassin's Creed 3. When we last left off, um... Blah, blah, blah. Stuff was oh, happening. Look at that. I found a third power source. Oh, a third power oh, source. It popped up in an earlier search, but I've only just managed to confirm it. Where? There's a museum in Cairo with one oh, on display. Oh, tell me we don't have to go Guess back. Yes, Connor will have to wait. No, you stay. We need to find that key, and time is running out. I'll make the trip. What about Cross? Everything's going to be fine. I'll be back soon. He's going to get killed. He's not going to be fine. Oh my god. Ready when you are, I Desmond. called it. Spoilers. Winter probably. approaches. The air is still and sharp with grim expectation. The others sense it too and go about their work with uncommon urgency. I would like to help them, but more pressing matters now demand my attention. The Templars have targeted George Washington directly, and will not rest until he is dead. I had hoped to shield him from this knowledge, but Thomas Hickey ended any hope I had of staying silent. And so I have resolved to share everything I know, of the Templars and their plots, of who I really am. Achilles finds fault in this, and we argue every day, but there is simply too much now at stake to maintain restraint. Don't do this, Connor! Then what would you propose we do? Sit and watch while the Templars take control? We are sworn to stop them, or have you forgotten? Assassins are meant to be quiet, precise. We do not go announcing conspiracies from the rooftops to all who pass by. Who are you to lecture anyone? You locked yourself away in this crumbling heap and oh, gave up on the Brotherhood drama. entirely. Connor's Since the still day I asshole. arrived, you've done nothing but discourage me. And on the rare occasions you've chosen to help, you've done so little, you may as well have done nothing at all. How dare you! Then tell me, on whose watch did the Brotherhood falter? Whose inaction allowed the Templar Order to grow so large that it now controls an entire nation? If I sought to dissuade you, it was because you knew nothing. If I was reluctant to contribute, it was because you were naive. A thousand times you would have died and taken God knows how many with you. Let me tell you something, Connor. Life is not a fairy tale, and there are no happy endings. No. Not when men like you are left in charge. Oh, drama, drama. Connor, stop being such a bitch. God. In your haste to save the world, boy, take care you don't destroy it. Ha! Blah, blah, blah. Like, this is so... this game, they just do such a bad job with it. I don't understand how, either. I mean... How hard is it to make an Assassin's Creed game? You know, make one that's good. It's like, oh yeah, you can play someone in the Revolution. Like, that's great, just write a decent story. And it's like, no, no, instead we're gonna write... The crappiest of stories. Uh, can I not? Uh, I can't fast travel anywhere because I don't have, um, I don't have any of the viewpoints unlocked. Alright, so that's what we'll do in this one. We will... Try to get to all the viewpoints. We'll follow the roads and see where they take us, I suppose. British guys... Just standing there in the cold. Not really marching, not going anywhere. Just standing, waiting. For nothing. Makes sense. Let's start going this way. No wolves. It's a good thing I'm on horseback and will outrun the wolves. There's just a ton of fucking 
wolves everywhere, and okay, here. And straight up a cliff horse, come on. You can do it. Uh, moose. Uh, we'll just climb, I guess, up here. So what do you think the next game is going to be? Um, the next Assassin's Creed game, I mean. Like, we had pirates, we'll probably... Well, no, what we'll... I know what we'll have. We'll have another pirates. Because, uh... It was successful. Oh, no, come on. Yep. There we go. Up. Thank you. So we'll probably have two, two to three Assassin's Creed games with pirates, and then, then what? What do you think they're going to work on next? Or what do you think the next, uh... Horsey. I guess it's only 300 meters. We can just run there. I don't know. I mean, don't get me wrong. I liked the pirate setting. I liked um, the Italian setting from Assassin's Creed 2. But, I don't know. Excuse me. It just feels like it's, you know... At some point, we need to stop the whole Assassin's Creed part and just make a game about you know, whatever historical time frame, and you make a character, and you, you know, make them likable, unlike this idiot. And just go from there, I guess. I don't know. I don't know, I'm just talking. Uh, trying to fill time, because I don't know... Don't know what to say. Don't know what to say. We'll climb this wall. Yep, that's exactly what I wanted to do, was do a bunch of extra jumping. And climb up here. Climb, 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 climb. Yeah, we'll have to be moving in, I mean, we'll, they'll probably, they'll, no, they'll definitely have a Civil War Assassin's Creed, because it's America, and it's too much of a important time period to not have, I suppose. Um, what else? What else are they going to do? Yeah, we don't care about that. Uh, this is the first game that I just don't care about any of the collectibles, honestly. It's a shame, because usually I like collectibles, and I like collecting them, and... You know, I... She oftentimes have a problem with collecting them, in that... I'm an addict, and I, I get addicted to... Uh, collectibles and all that other fun stuff. There we go. Can I not? There we 
go. Synchronize here. I mean, I like that you can climb trees. I like the setting. I just think it could have been done. Oh, and I'm dead. Ah, <laughs> uh, see, there was a there was a leaf bucket right next to me. Why didn't I swan dive? So you no, know, clearly you meant to just kill yourself. Okay, so we'll go here. Uh, I don't have my horse. Horse. Nope, okay, we're just running there. Easier than trying to find a horse at the moment. I like the animations for snow. The heavy snow stuff is nice. Maybe Napoleon, like Napoleonic Wars, would be an interesting time for uh, an Assassin's Creed game. Maybe, um, I don't know. You can go with, like, uh, wars in Africa and stuff, I suppose. Uh, colonial, but that's probably has too many racist, uh, racist overtones for them to be willing to tackle. Hmm. Kill a raccoon. Skin the raccoon. Where am I going? This way? Yeah, they'll pro- I don't know. Unfortunately, I fear they'll probably just stick to American history. Even American history, there's a lot of stuff that's just not... Well, I mean, I don't know. We have, like, a bunch of Latin American wars and stuff in the 1800s with America, but... That, again, kind of racist. So... I don't know. I don't know what they will be, uh... Come on, Connor, run! Is this Valley Forge? Must be. Or something of the sort, I don't know. Why would you not stay within your, you know, fortifications? As opposed to, you know, set up camp outside of it. There's George Washington. Come on, George Washington. Commander. Connor. Any word on Lee? Not yet. My apologies. I've been distracted. Supply caravans meant for the camp have gone missing. I suspect treachery. A traitor named Benjamin Church, recently released from prison, has vanished as well. The two events are surely related. What was his crime? He was caught sending letters to the Loyalists, detailing our troop strength. He claimed it was a scare tactic, that we might avoid war. A poor lie. I will find church for you. Why? What reason have you to help? Does it matter? As you wish. We've received reports of trouble along the southern road. Might be he's responsible. I suggest you begin your search there. How can you make George Washington boring? Ah, Connor. What do you think of my work thus far? The men are bolstered, focused. It is good you have come. I have no idea who you are. Uh, you are too kind. Lord knows my journey was far from certain. The trials we suffered getting here were strange and many. 
I dressed as a woman, Connor, to evade British spies. Did you know that? Oh, you were... I did not. As a woman, you say? It is the truth. King George had already stopped our crossing once in Bordeaux, threatening to seize my newly purchased ship, La Victoire, and arrest me. But I was born stubborn, and such a warning could not dissuade me. So we rode for Spain and bought passage aboard the ship there. George's spies had followed us every step of the way. Disguise was the only remaining option, mon dieu. No man can doubt your commitment, and you uh, are that's, invaluable um... to the cause. You did what you needed oh, to do. Oh, goddammit. French guy. You know, there's a street named after him in uh, New Orleans. <laughs> but of course you would. I expect uh, nothing less. Oh, frick. For yes. Uh, Continental Army, yes. Yeah, the Lafayette, yes, yes. See, I know my history. I just, I just don't know why I'm playing this. <laughs> it's so not fun. Also, we didn't meet uh, Lafayette at all up until right now. And it's like, oh yeah, you know us, right? And it's like, no, no, I have no clue who you are. The fuck are you talking about? There we go, that's at least a road. Okay, this looks like the site of this mission, perhaps. Father. Connor. Any last words? Wait. A poor choice. <coughs> Come to check up on church? Make sure he'd stolen enough for your British brothers? Benjamin Church is no brother of mine. No more than the Redcoats or their idiot king. Oh, I expected naivete, but this... The Templars do not fight for the crown. We seek the same as you, boy. Freedom, justice, independence. But... Hmm? But what? Johnson, Pitcairn, Hickey. They sought to steal land, to sack towns, to murder George Washington. <sighs> Johnson sought to own the land. That we might keep it safe. Pitcairn aimed to encourage diplomacy, which you cocked up thoroughly enough to start a goddamn war. And Hickey? George Washington is a wretched leader. He's lost nearly every battle in which he's taken part. The man's racked with uncertainty and insecurity. Only look at Valley Forge to know my words are true. We're all better off without him. Look, much as I'd love to spar with you, Benjamin Church's mouth is as big as his ego. You clearly want the supplies he's stolen. I want him punished. Our interests are aligned. What do you propose? A truce. Perhaps... Perhaps some time together might do us good. You are my son, after all, and might still be saved from your ignorance. I can kill you now, if you prefer. Excellent. Shall we be off? Do you even know where Benjamin Church has gone? I'm afraid not. I'd hoped to ambush him when he or one of his men returned here. It seems I'm too late. They've come and cleared the place out. I may be able to track him. Okay, this is where my problem was with this game, is that, honestly, Connor seems like the bad guy. Like, the Templars in this are pretty nice, like, they're pretty good, and it's like, oh yeah, we could have stopped this war, we could have avoided all this, we could have peacefully seceded, uh, we just wanted to help everybody. Like, yeah, because we want the Temple thing to control people, but, like, 
So what? Like, why did we? Why did we bother with this? Ah. Uh, anyways, we'll pick this up next time. I'm Agmig. This is Assassin's Creed Three. Take care.